from the channel uh, Stephen Nina's Homestead. We've actually prayed for Steve before as well, but uh, Nina's the, the one this week. Uh, and, and Nina has a history of fibromyalgia, fibromyalgia in some, some other things, but now she's uh, come down with congestive heart failure. So Nina's actually, well, she's in the hospital Wednesday. I don't know if she's still in there or not. But uh, Nina, I know you'll watch this and just know that our prayers are with you, sister. Uh, a couple of weeks ago, we prayed for Mary Ranch. Uh, now, Mary hasn't, and that's her channel name as well, but she hasn't posted a video in, in a long time, but I keep up with her on Facebook. Uh, but Mary wasn't feeling well a couple weeks back, and she has since made a Facebook post that she is still suffering from COVID and the flu. So, Mary, I know that's got to be tough uh, with, with all your other issues, and to have both of those. Just know that, that our prayers are with you, and I, and I know you'll see this. So just uh, our hearts go out to you, and our prayers go out to for you as well. Uh, the next request comes from Joyce at Morris Patch of uh, Heaven Homestead. And Joyce, uh, I think it was a Facebook post, not, not a YouTube video. Anyways, Joyce made a, a comment, a post uh about her son Jedediah, who's got braces, and a piece of metal broke off, and Jedediah swallowed that piece of metal. Uh, so they went to the ER, and they're just hoping, you know, that it'll do its natural thing and pass through without any damage or surgeons having to go in and get it. So let's just pray that uh, all that turns out okay with no surgery, hopefully. Uh... The next request uh, for somebody that's sick is uh, uh, Jamie from the channel All The Things. Um, and Jamie I have known for several years. Uh, Jamie actually used to work with my son John when John was a police officer with the Blackshear Police Department. Uh, so they worked together. And then when I went to back to school at the ripe old age of 40 uh, to get a degree in criminal justice, uh, I interned with the Blackshear Police Department. And Jamie actually is who I rode with. Uh, had a great time. Turned out to be, you know, not great friends because, you know, we don't hang out or anything, but, you know, just good old boys from the South. Uh, and I don't know why we don't hang out because we don't live that far from each other. Uh, Jamie no longer works at the police department either. Uh, he's got another job. But just all around great guy. Uh, but I mentioned the channel All The Things, and that's usually his wife, Natalie. Uh, so Natalie does cooking videos, uh, does grocery hauls, and we keep joking about uh, getting together because, honestly, we don't live 10 miles apart. And I don't think I've ever met Natalie, so, so that's the problem. Uh, you know, I talk about friendship in my Wednesday in the Word video, and here I am, got people that live that close to me that, you know, we just treat as acquaintances instead of friends, and that's what Jesus calls us to do is be friends. So hopefully in 2024, me, Jackie, Jamie, and Natalie can get together. So that's everybody that is sick. Uh, so this next request is sort of a... Uh, somewhat of a praise, but uh, a, a thankfulness for sure. And that comes from, uh, or comes for... Bob and Robin from Homesteading with Sadie because their area had a severe windstorm. I, I don't remember if they called it a tornado or not, but it definitely had some strong winds. Uh, just tore a lot of stuff up in their backyard. Uh, but thankfully, you know, they weren't hurt. Uh, thankfully, the house was, was spared. I think there was one little piece or something off of it. Don't remember now that was three or four days back, and I've slept three or four times since then. But uh, just thankful they weren't hurt. Thankful the house wasn't no more damaged than it was because you know, the stuff in the backyard is it's money. But again, that stuff can be replaced. You know, our, our health and all that's the most important thing. So that's my list for today. I, I hope I didn't miss anybody. Uh, but the one sure way of me not missing somebody is if you'll leave a comment in this video, then I'll make sure to get that, that prayer out next Friday. So with all that being said, let's go to the Lord in prayer. <clears throat> Dear Heavenly Father, Lord, again, Lord, just thank you for this glorious day. Lord, we just thank you for this joyous season. 
a season that's all about you. It's a season because of you. And it's also a season for you. Lord, we can't thank you enough for the gift of that baby born in a manger many, many years ago in a land far away from here. A baby that was born to come to this earth, to walk with us, to feel our pain and our suffering, and to ultimately take that pain from us. Even when we're not worthy of it, we know you're still there, walking with us, willing to share your love, grace, and mercy at any moment. All we have to do is open our hearts and receive. So Lord, I pray that if there's anybody listening to this that hasn't received you into their hearts, Lord, I pray they do so soon. Because we never know when our time is up. When we die, we're going to spend an eternity somewhere. Whether that eternity is in heaven or that eternity is in hell. We're promised to spend an eternity somewhere. So Lord, I just pray that we all hear the words that your scripture says. That we accept those words and that we accept you so that we can have life in the kingdom of heaven. But Lord, you know those names that we spoke a moment ago. You know those that are unspoken in our hearts. So Lord, we just want to lift up Nina, Jamie, Mary, and Jedediah. Lord, we just pray for your healing hand to touch each and every one of those and their families. To heal those, to comfort those, and to bless those. Lord, we also want to thank you for protecting the home of Bob and Robin. So that there was no more damage done than what they received. Thankful they weren't hurt. Thankful they still have their house. All the other things are just things. Even though sometimes those things are important to us. Nothing's more important than life. And Lord, we're also thankful that Autumn now is legally a Pafford and that she is now belongs to Charlie and Brand Brandy. Lord, they have loved her all her life and now they get to have her and call her their own. Lord, there are many children out there suffering and we all pray that someday they have a loving home like Autumn does. Lord, again, I just lift up each and every person to you hearing this video. That they come to know you and love you the way I do. And we just pray all this in the holy and precious name of your son, Jesus. Amen. So that ends this video. As I said, it's the Friday before Christmas. So it's the Friday when I'm making it before Christmas. So again, from my family to yours, we just hope you have a blessed day, a blessed weekend, and a Merry Christmas. Y'all take care.